Hey everyone, what's going on? It's Logan coming at you from Hunting Pros, and today I'm going to treat you to something new. I'm going to showcase my top five favorite shots of the season, and it's going to show snowshoe hare hunting footage and duck hunting footage. I hope you enjoy. So number five on the list, I was out with my buddy Charles in November of 2019, and we were having a great duck hunt, and this black duck came in. And so I see the duck coming, I shoot it, it falls out of the air, hits the water, but it dove. It just disappeared out of nowhere. Um, I didn't really know black ducks would do that. Um, he showed up about two minutes later in some sedge grass and I picked him up from there. But anyway, really cool footage. Hope you enjoy this one. Give it to him. <laughs> Where'd he go? Down there. He'll, he'll pop up somewhere. Did, did you fire? No. That was just me. So number four on the list is from a day I was out with my buddy Jeff Snowshoe hair hunting with my dogs. We were having a pretty tough day on the hares that day. The dogs were looping this one particular snowshoe hare around and around and around. It, we, probably, we probably chased the thing for I'd say two hours and finally my buddy Jeff lined up a shot through a thicket and made it and uh, the hair was dead. <laughs> we had an awesome day that day. I think we got two or three. Um, it's been a tough season that way, but anyway, this is number four. Get him? Sneaky little bastard, eh? Yeah, I seen him too, but I didn't want to say nothing. Partridge just flushed. There you go, Twiggy. Good girl. Good girl. Nice shot, man. Good girl. <laughs> Let's get out of here. So number three took place last fall at the very beginning of the duck season. Um, I was out with my buddy Tony. We were having a great day in the blind, you know, talking talking duck talk and uh, about a couple hours in out of nowhere these three teal dump in about I'd say a hundred yards away from us and uh, Tony's quite decent on the duck call so he's sitting there he's squawking on this call and it was pretty cool because you could actually watch the teal they were swimming right into us so anyway finally they get in within uh, shooting range I jump up I fire I think it was me anyway that slapped one in the water but what was great about this particular footage was my buddy Tony actually made a really nice wing shot on one of them as it was just exiting the frame. So that's number three. So number two on the list is actually a top contender for number one. So this particular day I was out with my buddy Charles again and we were out hunting for ducks. It was sometime in I'd say the early winter. Um, anyway we were out having an awesome day and what happens is two big mallards they splash into us. Now me getting excited didn't actually see two mallards. I was so focused on the big green head that came in that that's what I fired at. So I jump up, I water slap the green head Charles follows up by feeding another one into the green head and then we realized that there was also a hen with it that started flying away. Me using a double, I, I only had two shots and I missed my second shot, but Charles made a really, really nice wing shot when the, when the hen was flying away. So that is number two, almost number one, but number two. Nice. That mallard's still going there. I'll put another one in them. That's, uh, that's a green hit. Yeah. So we finally made it to number one on the list. Now this particular footage took place only about a month ago. Um, it was the end of snowshoe hair season and a new friend, Jeff, not the same Jeff that was previously in this video, but a new Jeff, um, met him online, he offered to come out with me to film some of my snowshoe hare hunts. 
Um, he actually just got a dog himself, which is awesome. So hopefully I'll be getting out with him more next year. But uh, he was standing behind me filming, first time anybody's ever filmed me. And the dogs are just baying on this hair and it's coming, I can hear it coming. And finally it shows up about, I don't know, seven to 10 yards away from me. And it came right to me and I connected with the old 16 gauge and uh, killed the hair. But anyway, that's by far my favorite shot of the year. I hope you guys enjoy, I'm gonna leave you with that. Please don't forget to like this video and subscribe, thanks. Good boy. Target, good boy. Good boy.